All right, kids, today we're going to do a little experiment that involves uh, hydrogen peroxide, baking soda, and vinegar, and uh, some flame. So um, all of the, the chemical um, descriptions will be in the Google Doc in the classroom. Uh, we're going to see what kind of a chemical reaction happens between hydrogen peroxide and baking soda, what kind of chemical reaction happens between vinegar and uh, baking soda, and we're going to do a little test with some um, with a flame to see what kind of things are emitted from it. Since we can't observe them in the classroom, we're going to try to do this out here. We're going to take uh, about 50 milliliters of baking soda. I'm going to measure carefully here. 30. That's 50 is going into this container and 50 is going to go into the other container no more all right All right, and we're going to take 100 milliliters of hydrogen peroxide. This one. And 100 milliliters of uh, vinegar. All right, we're gonna put both of them in at the same time. And we're gonna light this popsicle stick on fire. I have on my safety goggles just in case something goes wrong here. Okay, clearly we're getting a reaction. Right, yeah, I have a lit popsicle stick. Flame's going pretty good. We're going to make sure these are both mixed up. All right, we're going to take our flame, stick it in this one. Oh, and it went out right away. Again, it went out when it was in the bigger one. And this one, nothing. And this one, it goes out immediately. Um, we're going to figure out exactly what happened in these two chemical reactions uh, between the one that turned uh, a little brown with the vinegar and the baking soda and the one that uh, stayed clear with the uh, vinegar, I mean with the hydrogen peroxide and the baking soda. Thanks.